Um, so I'm actually going to, I've got a script. So internally, we're changing our devices. We're updating our devices. We're doing a device refresh. I've got a script that I'm going to stand in front of the front of the company with, but I actually want to create frequently asked questions from that script that what I'm going to present. So here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to loop in a new device presentation script, uh, which is once it loads up. So going on to going on to oh, going on to Charlie's point, it is all about that data governance to loop in my documents. All I've got to do is just put that forward slash. It is then searching everything that I've got access to as a user. Now, again, if you don't, if you've got the right access controls put in place, then it won't be able to surface anything that you don't already have access to. But it's those instances where, you know, things have been shared when they shouldn't have, or people have got access to something when uh, when they shouldn't have access to it. So using this script, and I'm going to show you what the script looks like, just so you can see that I'm I'm not cheating. It's not in a in a different format. It's literally a script. It's what we would go through within a, an internal meeting within 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 our within our sales team. I then got the document. I'm then going to ask it to create me a step by step guide based on that script um, that we can utilize. Within a couple of seconds, as you've seen, we've started generating that from that existing script. We've just given it what, we, what we're going to say. It's then extracting those different bits of information, extracting the main points, and then putting it into a document that we can send out to our, uh, to our, to our colleagues, to our employees. Again, a particular example where we're generating new content from something that is existing, but someone, this will be someone's job if you're doing a device refresh. They will have to write down all of the steps that someone's got to go through to get their device back on the network, back joined up to, to the domain, whatever it may be. With this, we're able to streamline that full process. Again, we've gone from nothing to three pages and 710 words almost. And it's not a one-time thing. We can come in, we can ask it to be more engaging. We can ask it to amend it. We can change the full prompt if we really want. It's a conversation. It's not a one-stop thing. It is something that we can go in and amend and, and amend dynamically if we really want to. I'm going to hit key because this is, isn't something that we need to that we need to focus on now. But again, the big thing is we've looped in an existing document and how easy that was for me to loop that in. 